Welcome to the Pro Kitchen Automatic Toe Kick Generation Demo. Many people have asked for the ability to generate toe kicks in their Pro Kitchen design. Uh, up until this point, we didn't have that because we had already designed the cabinet with a matching toe board, so the generating of, of toe kicks wasn't necessary. But for those of you who want to still add the toe kick, and for those of you who would like to add toe kick, say maybe in a different color, different wood species, to accent the rest of the kitchen, we've made this possible with this new process. Um, and again, like I said, it's automatic, so this is going to walk us through and show us how easy it is to set up and automatically generate the toe kick along with the rest of your moldings. So now we have to tell it what toe cook toe kick we want. Um, to do that we need to set it in our design settings. Now you can do this at the beginning of the design or you can do it later on in the design like we are now. There's two ways to get back to our design settings from your regular design. We can go up and hit our settings and then design settings or we can cheat and we can just come out here on our grid work not on a cabinet, not in a placement zone, but just out on our grid do a right click with our mouse and it pulls up all of our setting options. We want design settings. We click it, it takes us right back to the screen. This is the very first screen that, that we started with when we set up this design. Uh, we didn't, I didn't go through and set up all of these and I'm not sure how many of our customers actually do but they are there to be set up and we want the moldings tab for this one looks very familiar many of the Pro Kitchen users have been here um, here we can set up our light rail, our top molding and then new our toe kick uh, we want to start off first with our toe kick here and we'll add these others in later um, I did my design in Aristocraft but for simplicity's sake I'm going to set it out of sample catalog because I want to change it so that I can show you in 3D so I've got my toe kick set here that's all I need to do I could come here and I could choose a different one, but this is the one I want. I'm going to choose OK. It takes us right back to the layout. Now, to actually be able to place this, we're going to come over here to our Trims and Moldings button. Simply click the button, and here you see we have Toe Kick. Now, to demonstrate fully the extent of this Toe Kick, we're going to go and I'm going to go up to my Global Specs. And we're going to set it up. Well, I've already got it set up here. Now I've set it up in standard overlay. The door styles aren't going to matter. Drawer's not going to matter. Wood species will matter in this instance because I've done it different. Now, if you're doing it to match your cabinet, then you know, you'll set this up for the actual cabinet that you want. Now I've set it up with a finished color that is black, so it'll show up nicely in our layout. We'll close this here. Now I'm going to generate a 3D to show you exactly how nice the new toe kick looks. And I won't make you watch all of this. Okay, here's our 3D. And I'm going to zoom out just a little bit. Plenty close here. And there we have nice, dark, black accented toe kick. Now this could have been any color, it could match our cabinets if we wanted, but I did it in the black color in a different catalog just to show it off for the for the tutorial. So now you can see how quick and easy it really truly is to add our toe kicks. Now we could have added this if I had selected a crown molding and an under cabinet molding, it would have added all of those at once quick, easy, simple. And this has been the uh, Pro Kitchen Automatic Toe Kick Generation Demo. Thank you for watching.